Hello, welcome to Show of the Week. My computer's in the shop, so we're on my phone today. This is gonna be weird. I'm listening to Pins and Needles right now, actually, and I'm gonna fill you in on what it's like as I go on my walk. I don't know anything about this musical. Um, what stuck out to me about it, Barbara Streisand, it's one of her first recordings. It was originally written and performed by a lady garment-making workers union. So, seems really interesting. Got a punny title. Let's see how this goes. If you're looking for a good cabaret song, apparently nobody makes a pass at me. Very funny, nice down tempo, and good, good babs before she gets all stuck up in her making the song something different and something new. It's very true to the character. Lots of union jokes. Lots of, lots of punny union jokes, certainly, uh, if that's your game. Also, in other news, I almost walked into a tree a second ago. This is actually the way I enjoy listening to musicals most. Just me on a walk, listen to it all the way through. I think it's really important that the first time you listen to a show, you listen to it all the way through, because that's your only chance to really experience the show like an audience member, without having any preconceived notions about it, without stopping in between, and, you know, I'm breaking the rules a little bit by stopping and talking to you, and I'm also freaking out the people around me by just talking to my phone. It's very exciting. Wish you were here. Look at these ducks I found. Quack. They're coming to get me. I'm going to eat your soul. So it just took the most surprising turn from, like, gentle, pro-union propaganda songs to, like, really, really harsh governmental critique which is now what I expected. And then we cut to a nice slow tempo love song sung by Barbara Streisand. This is, it's just a weird collection of songs. So that's Pins and Needles. What a weird little oddity of a musical. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this week's Show of the Week Unplugged. I'm gonna go back inside. See you next week.